to drop the puck here at center. The Sharks start with possession as we are now underway. Moves it to Marchand. Carolina's got possession here in the offensive zone. Now a quick pass to Hamilton. Answered the call there. Not many times you get a clean look in the shot, so the goalies are always looking around. And they score on the board early here. What a disappointment for the home crowd as they get into their seats and already their home club is down one. Be pretty hard to do this better than they did on the odd man rush. They move the puck, they move the defender out of the way, and then two passes and it's in the net. Lots of time left in this period. one nothing the score. San Jose's won it. And he takes the dish. Throw fast. Denies him. It's in. He scores. Hard to get him much quicker than that. A pair of goals in 40 seconds. Wow, insane how quick that was. Bang, bang. Yeah, the defending team just couldn't put a stake in the ground. They couldn't stop them. Puck is dropped and play resumes. And now it's grabbed by Papa Doug Ambrose. And that's broken up. Oh, he looks like he's banged up there. He's going to try and finish the shift, but he's pretty clearly not at 100%. And he takes the pass. The Sharks have it against the wall. Centering in front. Oh, and he puts it into his own net. Carolina's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Shore. The Sharks have it now. And he takes a shot. And that one stopped. San Jose's got the puck. Carolina's gained possession along the boards. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. Long lead pass all alone. Oh, he didn't have enough gas to get the shot off. Really good work by the defender to close the gap. And that goes off a player. San Jose's got a hold of it along the wall. Nice feed at center moves up ahead now. San Jose's looking to break out of their own end. And play continues here. Quick pass to Shore. Oh, they had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Moves with the puck in the corner. Big stop by the goaltender right in front. Takes the puck. Shoots it. Scores! That's three! I had nine of these games. It is such a cool thing to score three. You feel so good about yourself. That puck clearly changes direction. Nobody's going to be able to stop that one. It's in the net. Past the halfway mark of this period, San Jose is now up by four. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Carolina's got a hold of it against the wall. Slides the puck across to Heatley. Carolina's got control of it now from their own end. Getting a little physical there with that collision. Into the corner of the attacking area. Here's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. I think through traffic like that, you just up, pull the thing hits you. Almost lost the ball. Hangs on here as play continues. Here's a chance in front. Takes the feed from off the boards. Slick feed. And it's in. They come in here. It's a home run for the thing. Someone makes it to reach for it. Well, you got to find something positive, James. I mean, a good chunk of this game has not gone their way, but they get on the board here. And maybe they can find a little energy, something to dig down a little deeper to get back in the game. The Sharks win it. Taken by Papa Doug Ambrose. And called for the offside. We'll get a face-off. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. And the officials waiting on passing here. The Hurricanes move the puck in the defensive zone. And now he 
moves it quickly to Heatley. Couldn't make the connection on the play. Into the middle of the neutral zone. Denies him in close. Here he is, wrestling on that. Wicked glove save to get a piece of that one. That happened so quickly, there's no help from the defense because the puck's there, and it's back at the goaltender again. He turns them both away. Let's get the call. Such a bad feeling. You know you're getting called for the trip as soon as the player starts heading to the ice. Well, as both teams dig in for the face-off here just moments away, it's our first opportunity to look at the power play unit here. Coaches always talk about the importance of excellent special teams. You don't necessarily have to score, but you can gain some momentum. Penalty coming up here. Oh, there's your old simple off the glass and out, except he shot it too high, and now he's got to go to the penalty box. Carolina's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. Hey, this is a pretty lengthy five on three here, James, and so I like a little bit of patience, but don't just pass the puck around the outside. It's got to get on the inside eventually. From the point, and he comes up with it. Puck scooped up by Heatley. The Hurricane scoop it up along the boards. And a strong physical collision on the play there. San Jose's got the puck in the defensive end. Carolina's looking to break out of their own end. He's got a step. Oh, what a stop on the breakaway. Good speed to break ahead of the pack. He thinks he's got the goalie beat, but shut down. That's a great stop. Just here in the late stages of this frame, San Jose's been the better team, and the scoreboard shows it. 4-1 is where we sit. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Sends it in on the attack. Handles the puck. Across the line along the left wall. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. Here comes the official's call. Everybody's trying to work their way through this, but everybody seems to be making the wrong decision out there. This night is not going very well. San Jose's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Absolutely fearless to step in front of that shot. And with that, the first period comes to an end. Both teams will have a chance to get a breather, and they'll be back on the ice with period number two in not too long. Well, let's see what period two has in store for us as they are about to drop the puck. Carolina's shorthanded unit gets off to a good start. They win the draw and take early possession. And he takes the feed. Heatley's got it along the wing. Takes the feed of the puck. Lays the body. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Marchand. Nice feed. Takes a shot. San Jose's latest chance results with a shot off the goalpost. Probably don't need it there, but the shooter would have liked it. And that's turned aside. Quinn's fought that puck all night long. He makes a good save there, James, but it's been a long night for him, and the guys in front of him haven't been much better. They don't score on the power play, but they accomplish a little bit here. They melt some time off the clock. They don't need the goal, but they don't want to make any big mistakes. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. 
across the line and on the attack. Carolina's looking to break out. They've got numbers. San Jose's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Russo's going to cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. The Sharks lead it 4-1. Gets a hold of the puck here in his own end. Carolina's got it now. Handles the pass. And he'll take a moment to regroup back at center. And he takes the feed. Oh, that an even better save. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. I hated that, James. As soon as you make this play, you know your next stop is into the penalty box. The Hurricanes send their man advantage unit out once more. When you don't get many power plays, you really have to make them count. One goal could be a big difference maker. Here's a short pass to Heatley. Spins it out in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Carolina's got the puck along the boards. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Moves it to the middle. Can't connect the play. Moves it to the middle. Couldn't complete the pass. Heatley's crossed the line and is on the attack now. Carolina's got it near the point. Oh, he stops him with the ball. Great reflexes there. Marchand's ready for the draw on this man advantage. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. From the point, looks to make something happen. Can't make it work. Moves the puck to Marchand. Both sides are evened up as the power play has expired. That power play was a lot of window dressing. They had the puck in the offensive zone, but really didn't generate a whole lot. The penalty killers must be pretty happy with that. Russo's going to opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. And it's been a pretty one-sided affair to this point. It's 4-1. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Marchand. And that goes off a stick and off to the side. Moves it to the middle. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. San Jose's got a little more jump in their step tonight. They lead it 4-1. Grabs it in his own end. Here we go. It's a two-on-one. Strong defensive effort. Quinn's going to bounce on it, and he'll take the whistle. He's usually a pretty conservative goaltender anyway, and so the opportunity to kill the play, he's going to take it. Both teams gliding into position, and the official set to drop the puck. Gets a hold of the puck. San Jose's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Puts it on net. That's gloved by Quinn. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Quinn's going to smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. You're almost at the point where the clock can't move fast enough. Down by a bunch and now short-handed. Another chance here on the man advantage. Haven't had a lot of power plays tonight, but when they jumped over the boards to come out for the draw, they were huddled together having a little meeting to make sure they're on the same page. Receives the pass. And that puck leaves the zone. And now it's over to Shore. Puts to the paint. Stopped by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. Carolina's got the puck along the wall. There's a firm collision. And he slides it quickly to Papa de Gambros. Oh, you got to love the effort as he blocks that. And that's deflected off some of the puck. There's the whistle. 
also, let's get the call from the officials. Not a great penalty anytime, but when you're getting pumped like this, it's no good. Time is of the essence for this five-on-three power play. Well, that second penalty will give him a five-on-three, James. They'd like to attack early. Maybe he can get one before the longer five-on-four power play. Handles it along the blue line. And that ricochets off a twig in front. What pressure here in the offensive end. What's picked up by the D. Scoops up the puck. And the defense come away with it here. And the D's got it in their own end. Grabs the puck. Carry it here in the offensive end. Big time collision there. Along the wall. Here's a shot. Scooped up by the D. There's a hit on the play. And they've got it in their own end here. Looking to clear from their own end. And they succeed in clearing and finally get a breather from their own end. Puts it on net. Good eyes up on the play. Russo's going to hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James. He needed a cover there. Here in the later stages of this period, the Sharks are giving their fans a lot to cheer about tonight as they lead it 4-1. And from off the wing, he comes up with it, but both centers scrummed up. We got a whistle, penalty coming up. The Sharks have been handed two for interference. The Hurricanes once again send out their power play unit. They've tried to jam things around the front of the net, James. I think they've got to go back to the point, open up some space, and shoot the puck from there. The Hurricanes gain possession along the wall. Hamilton got it against the boards. Cuts to the front. Big save. He makes that save, and he had to look through the screen. I don't know what he could see except the backside of that player in front of him. Shores ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Marchand's got it. Now they'll look to see what they can do with it offensively. One-timer! Shuts him down! Shores lugging the puck. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. The Hurricanes get a hold of the puck along the boards. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. you get on a power play that's rolling, you feel like there's a couple of different options. This team is good with the man advantage. Thankfully, your stories are good, too, Ferraro. Yeah, I don't know about that. The Sharks get a hold of the puck in their own end. The transition game now into full effect as they move across the blue line. That's a big-time yeah. hit on the wall. It is, James. I love the way he used the angle. He took away all the ice. And with that, two periods now in the books. Been a great night of hockey here on EA Sports, and we got the third period coming at you in moments. Welcome back, James Sabalski ready to bring you all the play-by-play. -play. And just like that, the clock is ticking on period number three. Once again, I'll send it back down to my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro. Is that ringside, Ray? We've got two periods played. How do you see this thing? Carolina's had such a meager total of shots on goal. Predictably, they haven't scored. They've got to get more pucks to the net. Maintains possession. 
Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Hamilton. That pass goes a little sideways. Directs it on over to Shore. Here we go, two on one. Carolina's got the puck in their own end. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Barnes. San Jose's gained possession along the boards. Odd man rush. And that's off a stick. San Jose's got a hold of it along the wall. And they'll keep on playing as icing is waved off. Stopped by the goaltender. Scores on the rebound and puts it home. Hard work shows up in many different places on the ice. This is hard work. You've got to fight your way into the middle of the ice, around the net. You're going to take some punishment. But with the pucks there, that's where the goals are. They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff. And he slides it quickly to Barnes. Couldn't make that one happen. And that pass doesn't go. Pass broke out. And that was a good heads-up read to make that save. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame, the Sharks now lead by three. San Jose's won the draw. Along the right wall and into the offensive end. Big time stop. Goalies don't beat this guy very often from this spot. He loves to shoot the puck. He's very yeah. accurate with it, but not this time. No goal. Carolina's going to play it from the corner. Stop, The Sharks will play it from the defensive zone. And offside, we'll get a reset here. And both centers glide into the dot as a face-off set to resume. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Centering feed! Great defensive play to pick off the pass. Takes the ball. He scores! In close, one of the game's better shooters. You cannot leave him alone. He does not miss there. San Jose's only continue to extend the lead here in the third. They haven't missed many chances. They've scored at will, and now we're coasting home. Puck grab by Papa Doug Ambrose. Aaron pass, and they can't connect. Right in front of the official's eyes, and the hand is in the air. The power play unit goes right back to work. There are times where this power plays look pretty dangerous tonight. Other times it looks like they're never going to get in the zone again. And there's a little help from your friends right there from off the wing coming up with the puck. Goaltender gave him nothing as it goes off the side of the net. San Jose's got a hold of the puck. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Play is blown dead with the offside. Marchand's ready for the draw as we get set to resume this power play. San Jose's won the draw in the neutral zone. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. Hard to try sometimes to work. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. Play blown dead. Let's get the call. Oh, he pulled his feet out, James. That's going to be called. It's a tripping penalty. A huge power play opportunity here for the man advantage unit of five on three. I always want to see the five on three a little more aggressive, James, than it usually is. I think the puck has to be moved quickly for an early Good shot. Job, dude. Where are the penalty killers down? Papa Dagobos is out of the box, but they remain shorthanded, and he'll join the penalty kill. Stoppage in play, offside the call.
Marchand set the face-off dot, ready to win this draw on the man advantage. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Gets it out of his own end. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Grabs the puck. Pokes it away in his own end. Takes the feed. Off the outside of the iron. A little burst of speed now as the puck's moved inside the offensive zone. Passes on over to Marchand. Both teams back to even strength as the power play comes up and oh. handle on that one. The Hurricanes take it along the wall. Thinking more and more offense here now in the third. No reason to sit back. You're in a hole here. You need goals and you need lots of them. Attack. Picked up along the wall by Papa Doug Ambrose. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. And they'll be forced to regroup after the puck bounces out of the offensive zone. Quick feed to Marchand. And they keep the pressure on. Carries the puck up through center. Takes it to the net. He scores! This might be a where were you moment for so many of these fans. And again, he gets a chance on goal and he makes no mistake about it. It's like a quarterback in football. You have to be able to distribute this puck at the right time to the right place. Done perfectly. And now it's in the back of the net. San Jose's added to their lead here in this third period. It's been non-stop. I like how they've scored and then gone after the next one, James. They've had their foot down on the gas pedal the whole night. Fails to find the open man. The Hurricanes gain control of the puck against the wall. Moves it to bars. Here's a shot, and he gets just enough of it with the glove and keeps it out. Oh, that's a hard save there. He's battling for position, battling for a sight line. He can't really see much through that screen, but he still makes the save. Carolina's got possession of the puck. Bars is taken down, and the officials are signaling for a penalty. back underway. Snaps it onto the net. And
Puck is dropped and play resumes. Sends a pass over. Final.
The skates are sharpened, the sticks are taped, the ice is ready to go. James and Ray ready to bring it all. Just moments away. The Aces take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Oh, and a good textbook hit there. Comes up with the stop. Great chance for the front. Montreal's got it in their own zone. Let's see what the officials are calling. That's an easy one, James. That's a trip every time. Get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. Well, hard work earns the first power play of the game for them, and now they've got to take advantage of it. They'll start with the faceoff, of course, in the offensive Stop, zone. Dude. And there it is in the back of the net. They tie it on the power play. They were telling us before the game, the coaches, that they feel like their power play's going to start rolling a little bit. Well, they got one here. He's equal parts sour and frustrated as that puck works its way through him. It looked like he had stopped it, but it rolls into the net. San Jose's got it in their own zone. Nice dish from the left wing. Takes the feed. Quick shot! Oh, what a stop! Pucks in the net, but the whistle sounds blowing the play dead. Lots of time left in this period. The Aces have taken a 1-0 lead. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Here they come on the attack. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. And now he angles it across to Shingra. Unable to reach that one. Poked away. San Jose's got the puck in the defensive end. Grabbed along the board by Papa Doug Ambrose. Oh, and they probably want to redo on that. Montreal's got the puck along the boards. Look at this down the right wing. They're on the attack. We got a whistle offside to call. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. Montreal's ahead 1-0. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. And sends it just out of reach. Tremendous hit into the boards, and that's a finishing play. No intention of stopping there. Early in the game, he wants to lay the hit on. And that slides right out to center ice. The Aces will play it in their own end. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Passes ahead from the right side. The Aces play it along the wing. Stop on the goal yeah. Kind of traffic in front of the net, James. He's still got to be able to see the puck. He can't. Makes the save. I think he bailed his team out there. Icing is the call. We'll get a reset. Centers are lined up, and we are ready to resume. San Jose's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Can't make the connection on the pass. San Jose's got the puck against the boards. Montreal's looking to break out. Tries to get the puck to Gingra. Stop, oh, and he denies him with a fantastic stop there. Dunlop's got it in the stop, dude. Good stand-up hit. Brands moving the puck through his own zone. And that's broken up. It's a three-on-one. Scores! The captain delivers. Well, that's about how you draw that up. I mean, you get an odd man break. You try to expose the defensive team. They scramble, and you finish. Perfectly done. More than half the period has expired. We got a tie game. And it's a quick pass to Brand. Nice pass. 
Dunlop's got it in the defensive end. Puck exits the zone. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Montreal's got the puck along the wall. There's the whistle. We got an offside. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Stoppage in play as we get an offside. Crowd's buzzing, ready to get things back underway, and I think the officials are too. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. San Jose's got the puck. Stopped with ease. Quick feed to Jingra. Hunderous collision on the play, and look at the bench set up. Puck clears the zone, and they'll be forced to regroup. Dunlop's taking it from his own end. Sends the pass over. Moves the puck. And he keeps that one out. San Jose's got him along the wall. There's the whistle as the play was offside. Getting into the later stages of this period. We are all tied up in this one. Locks them up on the draw as they take possession. Quick pass to Brand. The Aces have it now. Less than a minute to go here in the opening frame. Moves it over to Shore. Takes it to the front. How did he stop that one? That'll do it for the opening frame. We've got lots more still in store, so don't even think about going anywhere for rail fight. Seeds teams are on the ice. They're ready to drop the puck here for period number two. And we are underway, still tied up here in the second. And some textbook body contact there. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? The goalie reads his play really well. He gets out aggressively to make the save. That's a low slot shot. It happens quick. But he's in the right spot to make that save. That's it! He scores! Man, their bench jumped right up. Both teams know the longer you stay locked in a tie, luck starts to play a bigger part of the victory. It's hard enough to be the goalie when you have to stop the shot. This thing's like a rubber ball. It's bouncing all over the place and somehow ends up behind the goalie. That's a tough break for him. The Sharks have built themselves a one-goal lead here in the second. Let's see if they can build on it now. They'd like to take control of the game if they can. They now have the one-goal margin, but they want to stretch it out. From his own end, he picks up the puck. The Aces have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Sends it over to Brand. Oh, they had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Moves the puck along the half wall. Shot, Can't find his man. There's another for the hit parade. He might have a step here. There is it for the goal. Mm -hmm. 
Well, that'll make you go faster. You get a half a stride in the neutral zone. Now you got a breakaway. Look how quickly he pulls away from the pack. Makes no mistake on the breakaway. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. San Jose's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Puck picked up in the open ice. Couldn't make the connection on the play. Moves it to the offensive zone. Scoops up the puck now. And he slides it quickly to Shingra. Here's an odd man rush. It's a two-on-one. Moves the puck down low. San Jose's got control of it now from their own end. And that's picked off in the neutral zone by Brand. Oh, boy, here's trouble. Two-on-one. Can't make it work. Break right away. Nice hands, great finish, little short break in, in the net. I love this, James. I mean, this is kind of what I did. You get into close quarters here, that puck's got to go quick into the net. San Jose's on cruise control now, is that fair to say? It is, and it looks like they're going to try and get another couple of goals here. They're not letting down at all. just can't catch up to this. He's got his glove into position. Like he almost knows where the shooter's going, but the puck beats him clean. Still lots of time left here in this frame. Montreal still down by two goals in this one. Now a quick pass to Shingra. Unloads a shot! And it doesn't reach the net because it goes off a stick. Oh, oh, baby. His energy's been off the charts. He is looking to finish a check every time he's on the ice. Offside the call, we'll get a reset. That one stung, and he's slow to get himself back together here, James. I want to look at that again. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. San Jose's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Can't make it work. And that's broken up. Picked up along the boards by Papa Doug Ambrose. You'll need more than that to beat him. Sometimes the goalie's just better than everyone else on the ice. That shot comes in. It's a good one. And it's still trapped. But he finds the puck just long enough to react and make an excellent save. Another stop by the goaltender. Russo's able to breathe a little bit there. He's had a difficult night tonight, but they've still got a nice lead in spite of his play. Here in the back half of this period, the Sharks have some breathing room as they lead by a pair. It's 4-2. San Jose's got it in the defensive zone. Here's a short pass to Papa Dick Ambrose. And now he tries to get it across to shore. Oh, had a chance to make a nice move, and the puck disagreed with him. Tries that last move. Maybe he should just shoot the puck or get it deep. Got a chase now. Moves it quickly over to Shingra. San Jose's got control of it now from their own end. We got a stoppage. Let's get the call. Uh, he didn't like that penalty. I mean, it is a trip. But he's yelling at the other guy lying on the ice. Stand up. Quit diving. our first chance to take a look at the team's power play unit. It'll be their initial power play of the evening, James. The best power plays, they move the puck and move their feet at the same time. You'll force the penalty killers back a little more defensively than they'd like to be. And no luck on that pass attempt. Handles the puck at the point. Montreal's got possession while undermanned. And now he moves it to Cap. Montreal's gained possession along the board. Here's the play into that play. Here they come on the attack. And a little body contact on that play. The Sharks have it against the wall. Takes the feed from his own end. 
Quick feed to Cap. Gingras is up and ready to join the play. The Sharks fail to capitalize on the power play. And nobody's going to be very happy about that one, James. No real chances generated. His money close to the net. Pucks on his stick, pucks off his stick. And it's in the net with the accurate shot. The Sharks are almost making their opponents beg for the end of this second period, Ray. I'll tell you what those two locker rooms are going to be like, James. I've been in both of them. The one that's way ahead, it is a giggle fest. Everyone's having a good time. The other one, you can hear a pin drop from anywhere in that room. I'll take the giggles. Jose's got the puck against the half wall. Papa de Gombos has it now behind his own net. Here's a shot, and that goes off a body. Huge steal in his own end. And we'll reset things after that icing. Here in the late going of the frame, the Sharks now lead by three. And less than a minute to go here in the middle frame. Stones him on the play! Slides the puck over. Driving right to the front! Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Whoa! Scores! And from out of nowhere here in the dying seconds, they get one before the period start to look at that clock winding down and you just want to get to the end of the period. This is like a lightning bolt into the middle of this game. San Jose's won it. And that concludes the second period of play. Still one more period of regulation time. We'll see what happens in the third next. Welcome back. James Sabalski ready to bring you all the play-by-play. -play. Here's your change. Here we go. Third period set to get underway. Simply too much to not enough at this point. Well, we've got two periods under our belts to this point so far, Ray. How do you see things? Montreal's got to change the script here a little bit. It's great they've got all kinds of possession, but it's not been dangerous possession. Too much of it along the board. they got to get it into the front of the net. Start jamming away. Officials ready to drop the puck and get things back underway. San Jose's won the draw in the neutral zone. France lugging the puck. Takes the pass. Couldn't connect on that pass. Good fight for the puck along the boards. With the score! There's still a long road to go, James, before they can realistically think that they're back in this game. But you get one, maybe you get another one quickly, and you can turn the tide. Bad luck for the goalie, great luck for the shooter here. This is stopped about 90%. Hey, you got to stop 100% of it, because now it's in the cage. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Pass broken up. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. And they're off to the pace. He scores! What a finish! You get a chance like this, they don't come very often. You better put it away, and he 
done beautifully. Too sweet. Oh, he zipped that right past the goalie. He didn't even think about it deep. That's a quick shot. The Sharks win the draw here in the neutral zone. To his teammate. Comes up with a monster save in front. Montreal's got a hold of the puck. And now he moves it quickly to Gingra. Give it my oh, a collision with that hit. Known for this, he doesn't make any mistake. He moves the opportunity to lay a body check out. And he's right on it. Snaps it on net. And it's in again. Oh my goodness. What a night the home team is having here. And it's not a good one. You can't find the exit fast enough if you're a player or a fan. Man, what a rotten night. Everything that they've tried to make happen has gone wrong for them. This can't end fast enough. Setters glide into the dot as a face-off ready to resume play. San Jose's won the draw. Shores become the villain of this night. Every time he touches the puck, it seems like he throws it in the back of the net. He's a good guy for his team. The home crowd doesn't want any more to do with him, and they boo him every time he's near the puck. The Aces get a hold of the puck off the draw. Grabs it in his own end. And he takes the dish. Grabs control of it at the point. Here's a chance! And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. Russo's got it, and he'll elect for the whistle. Jumped on it pretty quickly there, and like everything else tonight, he's really looked in control. He's had an excellent game. Montreal's got it, and they're on the attack. And the goalie somehow gets a piece of that one. It's a tough part of playing goal here. You can't see the puck. There's a screen in front of you. You cannot give up on the play. You have to stay sharp. He does. and makes a really nice save. Oh, and he takes possession of the puck from off the wing with the centers all locked up there off the draw. It's a 2 on 0 What a... And it's in the back of the net for the goal! Yeah, I don't think it's going to matter, though, James. I mean, the, the puck clearly is in the net, but the ref waves this off immediately. Well, they obviously didn't like the call, but not a lot of time to dwell on it as we are ready to get play back underway. off the draw and that pass doesn't go San Jose is looking to break out of their own end and the extended stick ends that one takes control of the puck quick feed down low and now it's over to Brand means you will never forget your first goal guys this is his first goal with this club here and you know you never forget your first goal i'm sure his teammates aren't going to forget it either from the boards he takes that pass <laughs> what an unbelievable night it's at home it's exciting everybody is into it that's an outstanding game for him Montreal's back at center ice. They have a long way to go still here, though, Ray. Yeah, get your scores out there, James. Don't worry about the defensive end of the ice. You need goals. And he slides it quickly to Gingra. Montreal's got the puck. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. San Jose's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Moves it to Gingra. And not much on that one. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Montreal's got the puck in their own end. Chris Lundin close. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. The Sharks get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Puts it in deep. Montreal's got a hold of the puck now. And he feeds it down to Gingra. Puck knocked loose in the neutral zone. Good hit on the play. 
looking to make something happen along the boards. And now it's grabbed by Cap. And he makes the save. No one home on that play. Moves close to the point. And he takes the pass. And he loses possession of the puck after trying to make one too many moves. Shore's trying to do too much himself. Not a case of not caring. Just trying to take it all on his own shoulders. Officials have got both teams ready and it looks like play is set to resume here. San Jose's won the draw. Shores gaining momentum. Coming close. There's another great save. Quick reflexes give him the opportunity to make back-to-back -back stops. He grabs the puck here at the point. Oh, what a stop on the play. Came up with the save on that play. And that's offside stopping the play. This one-sided affair finally nearing the end. Another big hit! Man, this guy has one color on his mind, and it's the other team's jersey. Skate, hit, skate, hit. It's been that all night. Denies him! He got all of it! Russo's gonna cover up the puck here for a whistle. He makes a safe play and kills the play before any other damage can be done. The Aces win the faceoff. The Sharks move the puck in the defensive zone. And we got a two-on-one. Great save from in tight. Montreal's got a hold of it along the wall. Right up Main Street and on the attack. Read that perfectly with the poke check. Slitter and feed. They score! time tonight coaches nitpick over everything of there's course, never yes. anything they don't worry about and they would like them to have the puck more than they did tonight
What a fun night for some hockey on the ice tonight. Hi, everybody. James Sabalski here for EA Sports. I'm ready. I know you're ready, and these fans are ready to go. Opening face-off just moments away. Really been looking forward to see how these two teams match up tonight, and we are officially underway to find out. Pittsburgh's working the transition through the middle of the ice. Here they come on the attack as they slide the puck inside the offensive zone. And it's a quick pass to Papa Dick Ambrose. Zero fear on this guy's part as he blocks it. Gilmore has got the puck in his own zone. Tries to get it over to Kane. Taken along the wall by Shore. Oh, he's going to get called on that slash. Taken by Papa Doug Ambrose. Good reach for the stick to knock the puck away. And here comes the judgment from the official. Makar's stick work will land him two minutes for slashing. The Sharks get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. Now, you know, James, I like offense, I like goals. I even want to hear one of your goal calls. You haven't had a chance tonight. Nice job tying up his opponent. The Penguins get a hold of the puck along the boards. Here's a chance to get it out of their own end. And they get it down. Well, good communication. They talk to each other. They're in the right spot. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. The Sharks are getting called for boarding on the play. And on the heels of that call, we get ourselves a little four-on-four on, four on the ice. Doesn't take much for this four-on-four four to turn into chaos. One missed shot, one rim around the boards, and it's chaos. San Jose's moving it along the wing. And he had the answer on that one. As he slides in the butterfly, he's in great shape to make this save. The Penguins move it ahead. From the point, they take control of it. San Jose's got the puck now. Looking for space inside the D zone. The Penguins will have a chance to go to work here on the man advantage after the penalty expired. Shot! Good heads up play to knock it away. On the backhand! And he easily stops that one. Smothered that in close camp. We've got icing on the play. Face-off coming up. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. Still scoreless in this one. And from off the wing, he comes up with it with both centers scrubbed up. The Sharks scoop it up along the boards. Slip feed. Makes the save. Centers are set, face off, ready to resume play. Jesus wins possession in the defensive zone. Pittsburgh's looking to break out. Grabs the puck and tries to make a diagonal pass to McCarr. Through the offensive zone and behind the net now. Puck moved over to shore. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. Picked up along the wall by Gilmore. Takes the feed in the middle of the ice. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Quick pass across to Gilmore. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. The Penguins get a hold of the puck in their own end. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. 
Quick pass to Joshua. And that's turned aside with the blocker. Sorry, James. I jumped in there, but that was a huge hit as the play continued right past him. Turns it away. Puck scooped up by Shore. And now it's grabbed by Jesus. And he had an answer with that save. Puck grabbed by Gilmore. Here's a short pass to Joshua. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. Scoops up the puck here. Can't make the connection on the pass. On the deflection. Puck picked up by Gilmore. The Penguins have played from the defensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Joshua. Passes it to Shore. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Pittsburgh's got it in their own zone. Taken by Gilmore. Handles the puck. Kane's looking to make something happen here in the corner. Taking the lead here in the late goings of this first period. Pretty even first period. Now they've got the jump. You want to get into the intermission ahead. Jesus wins it in the dots. Puck scooped up by Gilmore. And now he angles it across to Kane. Sends it out in front. Moves it again. The Sharks gain possession along the wall. That'll do it for period number one. We'll drop the puck on the second period in just moments. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. Ray, three minutes into this one. What do you make of this one so far tonight? San Jose's first period was a mess. I mean, they were late to almost every puck. They started sluggishly. Like, they didn't have their legs. Sometimes that happens. Now they got to find a way to get back in the game, James. And it's got to start now. Lots of time left in this period. 1-0 is where we sit at this point. The Penguins win it. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. And that's broken up. Scooped up along the wall by Jesus. Moved up ahead here in the neutral zone. Just now you got to keep clawing back. Trailing in the game, they get the equalizer. This is what happens when a guy gets puck focused. He's now chasing the puck pretty soon. He's two or three strides away from where he needs to be. Can't get back to the slot to defend what he should be. San Jose's counter punch pays off. They've even things up here in the second. They've had really good legs since the start of this period, and it seemed like a matter of time before they punch through. And now it's grabbed by Papa Doug Ambrose. Great read in the offensive zone by McCarr. Denied by the goaltender. Russo's gonna slow things down and up for the whistle. Oh, you gotta kill the play eventually. That way everyone can get reorganized. Center's gliding up to the face-off dots here. Pittsburgh's won the draw. Great save by the goaltender on that one. This is where positioning is everything to the goaltender. He can't see it, but the puck hits him through the screen. 
San Jose's got it in their own zone. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the gut. Tried to connect the pass, but it doesn't go. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Jesus has won the draw. They'll go to work offensively. Quick feed to Makar. Oh, no! We expected it to be physical. There's an example of where this game can get to. Gilmore is stick handling in his own zone. And that pass is redirected. Picks up the puck in his own end. Looking to set up offensively. Beats the puck over. And he gets in front of that. I don't even know how you learn to shoot the one-timer like that. That thing sounds like a cannon coming off of his stick. There's the goalie. Track the puck in position to make the save. Quick feed down low. Slides the puck to shore. Oh, some strong physicality on the play. Along the half wall with the puck. From behind his own net. Along the wing up the neutral zone. Here's a shot. Oh, spectacular stop there. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Here's a chance. That seals over the net. A little banging and crashing now. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. Hey, this is one of my favorites, James. The old slashing penalty. I took a few of those in the day. And they'll roll the power play unit right back out. Time for the power play to go to work. They haven't had a lot of chances tonight. San Jose's won the draw. They'll go to work. Stops him with the glove. And we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. Jesus gets set for the face-off here as they will continue to play shorthanded. The Sharks take possession off the face-off. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. That pass doesn't go. Loves the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. Oh, a clutch save! There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. So they've been under so much pressure here in the defensive zone the last little while. They look like they're totally out of gas. This stoppage comes at the right time. Jesus wins the draw on their own end. The Sharks ready to go on the attack. Oh, they had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Couldn't make the connection on the play. Poked away in the offensive zone by Papa Doug Ambrose. Grabs the puck here in their own end. Poked away in the neutral zone by Papa Doug Ambrose. Time's up on the power play. Both teams back to even strength. Dismissed that chance. Here he is all alone. Oh, what a stop on the one-on-one. -on -one. What a great play to get in on the goaltender all by himself. But turned away with an excellent save. Just here in the late stages of this frame, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Moves it to Kane. And he takes the feed. In close. Great save on the play as he kicks the toe out. Look at this attack here in the ozone. Scooped up by the D. Can't make it work. Takes the puck at the point. Moves the pass in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Pittsburgh's got the puck in the defensive end. Moves it to Kane. Tries to the crease. Gets a stick on it to make the save. Some last second communication with the D as centers get ready to drop the puck. 
San Jose's got possession here in their own end. Nice feed. And there's the buzzer bringing the second period to an end. You don't want to go home yet, do you? Third period action still to come. are buzzing, teams are gliding into position here for the start of the third. Third period is now underway in this very tightly contested affair so far. Knocked away with the stick by Jesus. Pittsburgh's got possession of the puck. Quick pass to Kane. Oh, and it gets in front of that to make a great save. Even though he can't see the puck, he doesn't give up on the play. Stays engaged. Quick reflexes and he makes the save. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. We got a tie game. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Pittsburgh's got control of the puck. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Here's a chance to the middle. And that goes off someone in front. And she misses for all. I know what she's going to hear when she gets to the bench based on our conversations. Nah, the coach is going to be all over her to hit the net, but she knows that. She's trying to hit the net. She's just a little too fine. That puck's got to be in the middle of the net to have a chance. And he comes up with a stop there. And there we go. Icing is the call. The centermen glide into position. San Jose's got it in the offensive zone. They've got the puck now. We've got a tired defensive group to play against. Feeds it up ahead. Here's a short pass to Joshua. Nice save from point range. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Knocked away in the offensive zone. The Penguins gain possession. Trying to clear the puck. There's the whistle icing the call. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. It's all tied up. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. And that's blocked in traffic. Start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Grabbed along the board by Shore. San Jose's playing it from the side. Oh, he gets a toe on that one to keep it out. Pittsburgh's won the draw. Works it across to Papa de Gambros. And he goes out to shore. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. From the place 99 made famous. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Big save in front. Scores! Oh, James, all he had to do was stay there. He lost the puck, now he's turning around to find it, and he knocks it right into his own net. Oh, tough break. Jesus wins it in the neutral zone. 
Looks to get the puck over to Makar. And a great save! Manages to hang on. Handles the pass at center. Can't get it to go. Pittsburgh's got a hold of the puck. And he slides it quickly to Joshua. Big hit. Long jam in front. That's broken up. Smart defensive play to tap it away. Moves inside. Jesus is going to feel that for quite some time. You can tell the way he left the ice that he was not anywhere near 100%. We can only hope that he's okay. Past the midway mark in this period. San Jose's been the better looking team over the last few minutes. They'd love to build on this one goal lead. Handles the pass. To the low slot. San Jose's got control of it now from their own end. Shot. Oh, and another quick stop. Quick reflexes. You make one, you make two stops before the puck is cleared away. Been a couple times tonight, James. I thought this game was going to stretch out, but it's snug. And it's not going anywhere. This is how this league has become with the parody in. Center and feed! Great defensive play to pick off the pass. And the officials waving off icing here. Try to it in! The Penguins will play it in their own end. Feeds it over to Kane. There's the whistle offside as... We got a timeout on the ice. This is going to allow everyone to catch their breath here. Late goings of this period. San Jose is up 2-1, and the crowd has been enjoying this one. Oh, and he takes possession of the puck from off the wing with the centers all locked up there off the drop. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. San Jose's got the puck along the boards. Oh, look at this. They're outnumbered here. It's a three on one. And they score. And we've seen this sack before, Razor. You get in that close, and he's got the puck. Good night. He doesn't miss from there. You ask anybody around the league, and they'll tell you he's one of the most accurate shooters from this position on the ice. He gets in tight. He delivers the puck quickly and puts it right at the spot he wants. Official signals for the players to get into position, and we're about ready to drop the puck. San Jose's won the draw in the neutral zone. The Sharks looking against the half wall. Shores able to keep that play moving. The puck doesn't die on his stick as he stumbles and then is able to make the pass anyway. wins it. Pushes it across to Kane. That pass goes a little sideways. And that goes off course off a of body. San Jose's got the puck. Oh, great play to use the wall handling the pass. Puck grabbed by Gilmore. Couldn't complete the pass. The Sharks have it now. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Offside the call, we'll get a face-off coming up. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. And that pass doesn't go. Quick pass over to Kane. All alone! Once she gets out in the clear, I'm just 
just see it, a really confident player. Like she knows she's putting this away. That's a great goal. San Jose has won it. Great use of the stick on her part as she knocks it away. Drives it with the glove. Big draw looming here in the offensive zone. And that will close the book on this one here tonight. San Jose's performance, maybe not their A-plus game, but still did enough for the win. Even though it wasn't perfect, I thought they were in pretty good shape. There were some nervous moments, but your goalie's supposed to make some saves, and they come out on top. That'll do it for tonight's broadcast. For Ray, Carlin, I'm James. See you next time.